You don't crooked. think they're crooked. I think they're crooked. We never really felt the housing bust. We slowed down a little bit, but oh, not real that? bad. When was that, dear? 2008. Yes, and who was president then? See, she's already started. I'm just asking you a question. Who was the president then? When, when I first met her, we hit it off, like, instantly. The first date I had with him, we went to Pizza Hut. That's right. And he's talking about Star Trek, black holes, just make up quasars, or I, I don't know. He was talking about all this stuff about space, and he was like way over my head. I was just trying to tell her what they were. It's like a collapsed star that sucks everything I'd in. I never had a date where we talked about science. And it's like because we fought so much, all of our friends, they thought the last two years would be a miracle, and they're all divorced now. We agree on so few things. You, you sit there and go, well, how is this working? Sweet tea, okay? I thought we had peach tea. No, we don't. Oh, okay. By the way, Brenda does make a very good lasagna. Honey, I haven't made this in like 10 years. I know. So it may taste like doo-doo. It may, but it's... We'll find out, won't we? Why not Clinton? You say she's crooked. <laughs> Tell me how she's crooked. Do you want me to go over everything from yes. Whitewater yes. to their little venture? They Was have she going found now? guilty? Was she arrested? Was she's, she convicted she's of Whitewater? A lawyer. She's Was she does, a okay, lawyer? So by, she can find her way around so, it. So, do you like lawyers? I don't like lawyers. Okay. I worked for them. But you're saying and you're voting any, for one. What about Trump makes sense to you? Because he's a businessman. Oh and my I gosh. think a businessman who has had six bankruptcies. How many there you go. how many bankruptcies <laughs> has your company had? Has your two people that you work Brenda, for how many bankruptcies have people, they had? I, I honestly I don't care who's in the White House. I'm talking about the taxpayer. And I think that the Founding Fathers would roll over in their graves. Now, honey, the Founding Fathers would have rolled over in their graves 100 yeah. years ago. Right. They're making me pay for health insurance if I want to or not. You, the government says you have to have car insurance. No, you don't have to have car oh, insurance well, you if get, you don't you have get a car. Fined. If you it's make money, covered. you have to pay taxes. But, but here's the deal. You have to buy this product or we're going to fine you. Okay, and that's what they do if you don't buy car insurance. Dear, I don't have to bid, but buy car insurance. I don't have to have a car. It, regardless, I mean, no matter what, no matter what our disagreements are, no matter, you know, which way we go, we've, we've had things that should have split us up a long time ago, and we're still together. So... I think it's because nobody else will live with us. So I don't. I, I don't particularly know of anybody that would live with mm -hmm. me on a daily basis. Because I'm, I, I'm very um, controlling, moody, picky, picky, um, demanding. It, it's again. Remember what I told you about the Star Trek episode, where you have the aliens that live just. They're a little bit out of phase. They're in a different universe, a little bit out of phase. Sometimes that's the way we are. We're just. We live together. We're a little bit out of phase on that. Not little, I'd say. Yeah, well, sometimes it could be. I love each other. Yeah. This isn't going to come out and break our marriage because I know Hillary's not going to be changing my diaper when I'm 90, and neither is Trump. He will be. He'll be there. So that lies underneath everything, you know. It trumps everything else. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to use oh, that gosh. word. But, but basically, he did that on purpose. I really didn't. That's really the word you got to use there.